Hi everyone, welcome to Appliance Advisors with Yale Appliance. I'm Francesco, joined by Dennis. How are you today, Fred? Very good, yourself? Great, great. So you may have seen our earlier episode and we talked about is steam cooking worth it? Today, we're just gonna dig a little bit deeper and we're gonna talk about some of those steam cooking brands. Now, you know, there is some other ways to cook with steam, but today we're gonna to focus mostly on steam wall ovens, which is kind of the most kind of common way of cooking with steam. So talk to me a little bit about kind of steam cooking, wall ovens, and some of the brands that consider that. Yeah, I mean, certainly these brands, there seems to be two that we always think of yeah. at the very top of that. And I'll give you the one and you fill in the blank yeah. on the other. I would say uh, Gaggenau. Yeah, and I would definitely go with Mila after that, for yeah. sure. And why do you feel, those two brands, why do you feel like they sit at the top of the list? Yeah, so specifically when it comes to Mila, you know, I think steam cooking still, while it's it's not a brand new way of cooking. It can definitely be intimidating for some folks because it's different and they've never used it before. Mila is really kind of one of the best because their controls, and you know, we talk about their controls a lot in a lot of different appliances from ranges and other wall ovens and things like that, but they make it easy. You know, their master chef controls kind of guide you on how to cook with steam. So, you know, they make it easy for someone that wants to, is a little nervous to maybe get into it, but wants to try steam cooking and just makes it really kind of easy for that everyday chef to kind of to cook with steam. How about yeah. Gaggenau? I mean, Gaggenau for sure. I like that's kind of that person that absolutely knows they love steam and isn't intimidated by it at all and wants to almost take that next step into uh, not professional yeah. cooking, but really, really get in in there. And it, it has such precision in its controls. Um, side swing ovens, uh, yeah. side swing doors, which I really like, just ease of access. Um, and you know, people think of these things as just steaming vessels, but you can actually you can actually bake in these. Definitely, right? yeah. yeah, and absolutely. broil, and broil, broil, yeah. broil in those yeah. two, anyways. Yeah. And then, so that's kind of why I like the Gaggenau brand. But what other brands would you consider if it weren't those two that we've said at the top? Yeah, so where definitely do we go? some other really popular brands. So you know, Wolf of course has you know really popular uh, steam convection oven. Fisher Paco, uh, Thermidor. So there's a lot of other brands that are out there for sure. You know, those two kind of tend to be kind of two of the top and the best, but there's certainly a lot of other. Yeah, when you get to everyone else, honestly, there's a couple of companies overseas that are making those yeah. or, or, you know, to the specifications of those brands. But um, yeah, I think you can't go wrong with any of them. They all do a really good job. You know, those top two kind of are the ones that kind of launch it in, in, in at least absolutely overseas, but also in the US market and then everyone else is kind yeah. of followed. So they're still kind of at the top of the list. Definitely. Talk about size a little bit. So, you know, when you look at a steam oven, you know, a lot of them tend to be a little bit smaller, but there is some variation in size. Yeah, there I mean, too. you can get bigger sizes uh, either way. And that's always a common question with steam ovens because people just really want to know it looks small to them, but it does need a tighter space to encapsulate. Now, I've seen it where you can put a 20 pound turkey in them. I mean, they really yeah. can, and they make specific pans that that make that easy that you would want to buy, obviously, when you do steam cooking. But, you know, size is is a thing, and some of them have XL versions, i.e. Amila or, or brands like that, Thermo, yeah. or even yeah. that have some bigger sizes out there in the market. Yeah, and if you ask kind of, you know, why are they a little bit smaller? Part of that is that, you know, when you're cooking with steam, you really want the steam to kind of engulf the oven. So the larger the oven, you know, sometimes the more You'll difficult it can be. Correct. And if you don't, you know, a lot of these kind of have that reservoir. So, you know, the bigger the oven, the more often you'd have to refill it if it's such a huge kind of oven capacity too. But they're definitely getting bigger in some brands, like you said. So I think that kind of covers everything on steam Excellent. cooking brands. Uh, again, specifically on wall ovens there, really. Our next episode, we're gonna switch gears a little bit. We're gonna talk a little bit about dual fuel ranges versus all gas, and is one really better than the other? So hope you enjoyed this episode, and we'll see you next time. Thank you. Sounds great.